for a very affordable price on our new show, Cheap Clean Eats! Yay! So today we are going to make one of America's, or maybe the world's, most favorite food. If you look at these ingredients right here, what do you think it looks like? Let's head over to my local Trader Joe's store. First, we're gonna pick up some cauliflower. We need one cup, so it ends up being 60 cents. Then, some mozzarella cheese. I'm getting light, one cup, $1.30 for what we're doing. One egg. Out of a dozen, it becomes 15 cents a piece. Next, one teaspoon of dried oregano, basically a penny. Then, half a teaspoon of garlic, basically 10 cents. Half a cup of pizza sauce, 60 cents half a cup of mushrooms, I love mushrooms, 60 cents, half a green pepper, 35 cents, and half an onion at 55 cents. And this all totals to 426 for the whole pizza, that's crazy, so if you share that with three people, it is 140 to a person. What? That is nuts! Ding! Okay, so we are going to take off all of the on your cauliflower first. So I'm gonna cut this into thirds because really, um, one cauliflower will give you about three pizzas. So we're gonna just try that. They kinda look like brains, but they're good for you. Good for you. So you get your food processor out. I love this thing. So this is why we had to make them small. Got some chunkers. We'll grind you up later. Look how pretty this rice is. Look at that, isn't that beautiful? Look at that, oh. So after you have your beautiful cauliflower rice, what you're gonna do is place it in your microwave for about eight minutes. While we wait for the cauliflower to steam, we're gonna cut up one of my favorite fungi, mushrooms. So good. And then we're gonna go ahead and chop up our green peppers. This is gonna add such a nice splash of color. Finally, onions. Look at that radial design, gorgeous. And chopping that up, and I think this color combo will be fabulous. A little garlic to add some of that Italian flavor. Woo, it's hot. Okay, so take a look, take a look. This cauliflower is steaming. It is beautiful. It looks like Parmesan cheese, but now we're gonna put some mozzarella. And bam, I'm just gonna throw it in there. This is really to mush it all together. And I also want you to crack an egg. So we're gonna get, we're gonna get messy here. And that is one of the fun things about cooking. I am so excited to get my hands in here. Here we go. Mm, oh, that is hot. because we just clearly put this in the microwave for eight minutes and you cannot use your hands to mix this all. But look at that steam. Ooh, and come, come in here. Look at how this all melts together. If you don't want to eat dairy or you don't do dairy, you can also get soy cheese or almond cheese. This is what our crust looks like right now and we're gonna go ahead and put it on a pizza pan. So now I'm just going to spray my pan with some pan here and then we're just gonna pour on our amazing cauliflower crust. Oh, look at that. I could just eat it all by itself. Look at it. You can make this for your whole family. Even if your mom or dad, they're like, what is clean eating? Do you just eat like cardboard boxes and lettuce leaves? No. You're going to show them that you can eat pizza, that you can make stuff and they're going to think it's so unhealthy, but they don't even know it's good for them. That, guys, is successful and fun clean eating. You know, funny story, when I was in geometry in eighth grade, they had a circle drawing contest without using any type of tool. Toast to comb the award. That is your pizza crust, what? So my oven is set at 350 degrees Fahrenheit. We're gonna leave it in there for 10 to 15 minutes. All right, let's go back. So I have half a cup of pizza sauce. 
obviously if you want more you can put more oh there it is okay let's go ahead and mush that around doesn't that look so good now that all the pizza sauce is on we're gonna put on the cheese so the cheese that I'm using is basically the low-fat kind of cheese from Trader Joe's. It really helps lessen the amount of calories. It still is full of flavor. Now we're gonna put on some onion. Oh, so pretty. Now we've got our bell pepper, adding a splash of green. Oh, it's like making art. And now my favorite, mushrooms. Love mushrooms, I can eat them forever and ever. Ooh, did I go crazy? We're now gonna put it back in the oven for 10 minutes and then we'll have a slice. Here we go. that cheese oh for days it won't even stop look at that gorgeous texture so do you know how many calories is in a normal Domino's medium-sized veggie medley pizza have a guess did you guess 1920 calories for the whole thing how about you guess how many calories are in this whole medium-sized cauliflower pizza 616 and you get eight slices, making each slice. Somebody do the math, somebody do the math. Mm, 77 calories a slice. What is that? Like, look at that. What? That's crazy. So now that you have an amazing looking pizza in front of you, and it's only 77 calories, it's full of nutritious and delicious vegetables, I think it's worthy of eating. What do you think? Should I eat it? I think I'm going to eat it. Make sure you're subscribed and be sure to eat well because I'm watching you.